Hey everyone, here I'm doing exercise 10.3 first question. This is menstruation chapter of class 6. The question is, find the area of the rectangle whose sides are. We have given four questions. The first one is 3 cm and 4 cm. This means length and breadth are given. We have to find out the area. So let's start with the first question. Now let us take length as 3 cm and breadth as 4 cm. So B is equal to 4 cm. Now area of rectangle is length into breadth. So area is equal to length into breadth. So this will be equal to 3 multiplied by 4 which is equal to 12. And the units will be centimeter square. Because you are multiplying centimeter and centimeter it will become centimeter square. Now second question. In the second one length is given as 12 meter and breadth is equal to 21 meter. Now area will be equal to, so area formula is length into breadth, area of rectangle is length into breadth, length is 12, so 12 multiplied by breadth which is 21. So 12 into 21 is equal to 252. So we'll get 252 meter square. Then the next one, in the next one problem C, we have the units in kilometer. So length is equal to 2 kilometer and breadth is equal to 3 kilometer. So area is equal to, so don't forget to write the formula every time you, you solve the problem. So area is equal to length into breadth. So length is 2 and breadth is uh, 3. So 2 3 is a 6. So 6 kilometer square. Now in the next one, the fourth question, we have a different unit. We have meter and centimeter. So before we solve this, before we find out the area, we have to convert into the same unit. Now this is the last question. So this is problem D. So length is equal to 2 meter and breadth is equal to 70 centimeter. Now you can either convert meter into centimeter or you convert centimeter into meter, anything. So here I'm going to convert centimeter into meter. We know that 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter. When you're converting smaller unit to the greater unit, we have to divide. Now since 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter, we have to divide here with 100. So breadth will be equal to, so B is equal to 70 divided by 100. So we have a two zeros in the denominator so this will become 0 0.70 I'm just converting into decimal here so place decimal point from the right side from the right side you have to after two digits you have to put decimal so we'll get 0 0.70 or 0 0.7 meter now we can find the area so area is equal to length into breadth so length here is 2 meter so 2 multiplied by breadth is 0 0.7 when we multiply this two, we'll get 1.4 or you can write down 0 0.70 then 1.40 will get. If you don't write 0 then that is fine. So 1.40 meter square. So this is the first question. We have a four question they have given. We have solved. We have got the area. I hope this question is clear. In case you have any other question or doubt, you can drop a comment below. Thank you so much for watching.